Hi, so this is my Lego half size um, robot reveal for the Vex over under season. Um, and it is like Lego, so it's unofficial, but it's still pretty cool and it was really fun to make. So this is how I'd start the match um, just to fit within size. And then I just spin the intake like that and the intake can lower because of this rubber band. Um, so yeah, I'll start talking about the intake. So the intake, it's really nice. You can feed the tri-ball through right here, um, and then you can intake it. And then you can't really steal it when it's like this. And then if I put it down in the middle, you still can't steal it because of this rubber band. So that's just really nice. It has this bumper bar so you can push it in. And then um, it can just push in the tri-ball like that. Um, if the bot doesn't get stuck on the stuff like it did, but that's fine. Um, but yeah, so that can go under and it just works really well and it's really consistent um, for at least intaking the tri -ball. This is a little weird of a setup, but yeah, so it's really nice um, and that works. So the next thing I'll talk about is the drivetrain. So the drivetrain just has one motor on each side. It's rather slow because it's Lego and it is one motor, but uh, it has four Omni wheels, but they're only half Omni wheels, uh, just so I could have them thinner. Um, and then it has like four traction wheels that go in the middle. So these do scrape the ground when you turn, but it's not a big problem. And then these ones, they're not always touching the ground, but that's also not a big problem because its center of gravity is close enough to the middle that it doesn't tip. <coughs> um, and then you can see the gearing a little bit um, on it, so these move about, about the same speed on the wheels, like that, the parts of the wheels that contact the ground, so there isn't really any like weird pulling of the drivetrain or pushing, um, even though they are wheels of different sizes. Um, so for the next thing, I'll talk about the wings. So the wings, this is Lego, so I don't have Lego pneumatics, and they're kind of, um, like, big in their own, so I don't think I would have been able to, like, implement it on here. But, um, with that, uh, okay, there we go. So with that, there are the wings, um, and I use... Uh, relative positioning so it knows where they are and stuff. But they go up and down and then they can push the tribal over it. And it works really well and they're scaled for being like 34-ish inches. Um, and they're just really nice. The rubber bands here, um, they allow them to like fall down in the beginning and then they just push down more. Uh, so these rubber bands, they're really nice. Uh, yeah, so the next thing I'll talk about is the lift. Um, so the lift is... is uh, it's kind of weird, but it works fine, um, sometimes, I don't know, it's, it's kind of weird. So it holds the catapult, which you press the triangle button to prime, um, and, uh, you can hang right here, and then, uh, you place the tri-ball like that, so I can launch it like that, and it works pretty well. I don't know if it would get over the middle barrier if I was in an actual match, but uh, it is Lego, so I don't know if I'd be able to do that much. Um, and it's probably the only Lego one out there, so I'd probably win whatever competition I'd be in anyways, so it doesn't really matter. Um, but anyways, it can hang on the bar here. It has a really bad center of gravity. What? Okay, well, yeah, this is a kind of weird setup, but if this doesn't break, it has a really weird center of gravity, um, so it just tips back most of the time. If this, uh, if this goes up, then it can hang and it bounces sometimes, but, like, it's, it's not consistent for going like that. But, if you are to hang, not on the horizontal bar, but... If you're to hang here, and if you look, it's high tiers right there, so it's high enough um, for, like, hanging in the hole. This is just the wrong length of a pole. Anyways, it hangs here, I can press the button, and it can go up like this. So, this is more what it would be hanging with, just because it's easier. Um, and I'm not sure the tier it would get, it's probably like a B or C tier hang it gets, but it's still pretty nice. <coughs> So, 
yeah, there's that, and it's just really nice. This can work as a blocker, but it was just really fun to make, and I think it's better than my last version of a bot, um, just because, like, the intake is really nice, and I don't have, like, the distance sensor I had on the last one, which is kind of weird. Um, but yeah, it's really nice. Uh, I think the best part is that you can just load it through here, so you can um, go through the alley and score those points really easily. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. Um, please like and subscribe. That would be really nice. Um, but yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye.